We begin right away with breaking news team coverage this afternoon for Toledo City Council members under criminal investigation. Our cameras rolling as a Toledo City Council member is handcuffed in front of her central Toledo home. WTOL 11's Amy Steigerwald is live from that scene. We're going to get to her in just a moment. But first, we just got our hands on an affidavit filed through U.S. District Court, which states the four council members plus a local attorney accepted bribes for votes. We go to WTOL 11's Kaylee Kirby to break down that document. Kaylee. Yeah, Amanda, here's what we're learning right now. WTOL 11 obtained court documents showing that federal agents have been investigating Toledo City Council members for two years. Now, someone reportedly tipped off federal investigators about bribes in May of 2018, about years of misconduct. The case centered around allegations that Tyrone Riley, Yvonne Harper, Larry Sykes, and Gary Johnson accepted bribes from business owners in exchange for their votes in City Council. This afternoon, we've learned the FBI tracked phone calls, text messages, and in-person meetings. They've also com combed through financial, business, and government records. These documents alleged Harper used attorney Keith Mitchell to funnel bribe payments. The FBI tracked several specific accusations of bribery involving Riley, Harper, Sykes, and Johnson spanning years. Now, coming up at 1, I will be at an FBI press conference that is here in downtown Toledo. We will be streaming that on our fa on Facebook, on our app, and live on air. Amanda? Okay, Kaylee, thank you so much. We continue our team coverage this afternoon. Amy Steigerwald live outside Yvonne Harper's house. Now, Amy, neighbors you spoke with actually saw her get put in handcuffs. Yeah, that's right, Amanda. I spoke with about four or five neighbors who were outside here uh, off Franklin Avenue who all saw Yvonne be put in handcuffs here outside her central Toledo home. Now that was around 1030 this morning. At the time there were really no other marked law enforcement vehicles here, so no one really knew what was going on. Now right now things are pretty quiet here. There is no law enforcement on scene. Some neighbors still outside their homes kind of talking, but overall it's pretty quiet. And like Kaylee said, Yvonne Harper accused of bribery and extortion. Um, neighbors tell me they obviously never expected something like this out of Harper. One person I spoke with says she's known her for about 15 years and watched the whole thing unfold right here. I look up and I can't get up no close because there's a lot of people. I seen a gentleman handcuff her and then they set her in the car. And it, and it worried me. I'm like, well, what is she going to jail for? I mean, I just talked to her. It wasn't nothing wrong. So I didn't understand. Obviously, a lot of shock here right now. We're going to obviously continue to follow this. Stay with WTOL for the latest. Reporting live in Central Toledo, Amy Stagerwald, WTOL 11. All right, and we do know, again, the FBI is going to be having a news conference at 1 o'clock this afternoon. We will bring you the latest as it comes in on the air and online. Download our free WTOL 11 app to remain connected.